Hey everyone, Team UDF here, for reals this time! That's right, for the 1,000th video, it's finally time for the face behind Team UDF Gaming. And ladies, it is a single face. Oh, stop it. So what it is time for now is the top however many moments from Team UDF Gaming's first 1,000 videos. I have thrown together the clip show. I mostly tried to stick with the videos that you guys voted for. However, in some cases, there were some things I thought that might have been overlooked, or I wanted to reduce the video time. Because I know some of you guys can't download the longer videos, but this is going to end up being a pretty long video anyway. But in any case, I just want to make sure that I thank you guys before we begin for subscribing to Team UDF Gaming because you know I don't advertise. My name is definitely not out there by any means. So to have over 2,200 of you guys subscribing, that means a lot to me and I think it really says something. So again, thanks to you guys. So let's go ahead and get started with the clip show and... You know, enjoy the show. Here's to the next 1,000 videos, here's to all the subscribers, and here's to Team UDF Gaming in general. Cause he do Nolan said he'd do anything to join the Mythic Dawn. Well, that was a big mistake. Hello, everybody. Cause he do Nolan here. And today... We're going to start The Legend of Zelda Parallel Worlds. It'll be a lot of fun. This is going to be my first Let's Play. And we're going to spell my name in capital letters. Because... Th oh, there's no room for the H. Ah, damn it. Well, that's okay. Let's begin. Here's to a great game, everybody. I can't. I can't do it anymore. Goodbye, cruel world. Ah. And now here's possibly the first time I ever just spazzed out and did random stuff in my videos. All right. No, she's not done yet. Ah. <laughs> Too much skooma! Too much skooma! Damn it! I'll tell you when I've had enough skooma! Now hit me again, barkeep! Oh, ho, ho. this is... Run! Ding dong doorditch! Ding dong doorditch! You have my ears, citizen. Faster, Cleon! You're holding the line up! Did he see us? I don't think he saw us. Haha, <laughs> excellent work. Oh, joy, Clan wants to talk. What is bothering you? Foolishness. What is it? The manner in which you conduct your battles is ill-suited to the conditions you face. You lack tact and strategy in your encounters. No, I don't. Well, maybe I do. You seem desperate to throw away your own life by charging at the hordes, which, uh, when discretion is the better option. And the fights you can win without unjustified risk, you dismiss as not being worth the effort. This is hardly the way for a potential leader to add. Uh, yeah, yeah, lecture me, blah, blah, blah. What do you propose, ingenious? Rather than the two of us being forced to rely on your limited strategic abilities, we instead follow my command. You are familiar with my history? You know I was a general and a great leader of men. I was undefeated in battle. Good for you. And use my prowess as a commander to keep the two of us alive and to make our enemies suffer greatly. Oh, are you trying to usurp me, huh? Well, nobody usurps Zelos. Ah, uh, we're a team. We're gonna work together. Screw you. Because if I be too mean to him, I might lose a good ending to the mod or something. I don't know. Those are supposedly multiple endings. Well, he'll run away from us if we're too stupid. Alright, men. Uh, women. I don't know. I, I, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna prove Cleon wrong. So, this next mission is of the utmost importance. Draw your weapons and prepare for battle. Now, charge! We're taking him down. Okay. Now ring the doorbell and run. <laughs> ding dong door ditch. Ding dong door ditch. Suckers. Hide. Did he see us? I don't think he saw us. Excellent. Good work, my friends. Good work indeed. Alright. I told you I didn't have enough. Give me another hit, you jerk. Take that. Maybe I did have too much to drink. Impus ways. Roll it. <gasps> I 
Guys, only two people voted for Mass Effect 2 footage. Well, that's okay, because I found some clips that I think you guys might have forgotten about, or they're just buried in there for some reason. But in any case, it is time for Mass Effect 2, and this is a story of toxic drugs and probing. Oh, now look what you've done. You burned her. Now, how can you get the knock list? Can't do anything right, Shuffy. Oh, oh, the high impact shot got her. I've got a high impact shot for her. It's called incinerate. 360 degrees of incinerate, punk. Oh, now there's more. Now there's always more again. Now there's toxic crap all over me. And I've got no health. And I don't have the drugs. Shepard, you didn't get the drugs. You lost the drugs. What the crap is your problem, Shepard? I don't know what you're doing. But you lost the drugs. And now we have to complete the mission knowing that you lost the merchandise. I don't know what you thought you were doing when you dropped off the package. But you lost the drugs. But now our non-existent biotic power is much more powerful than before. See, they weren't before, but now they are. Because it wasn't before or after, but rather it was later than rather before instead of after but not later. Which translates to... Toxic drugs. They've seen us. Oh, what they've seen us! Not a Again. They just see us on every mission. This is stupid. Why would the enemy spot us when we're shooting at them? This game makes no sense, man. This game is stupid. Why would the enemy spot us? Garrus. Jack, rather. 
Look at you. You can fly. See, I knew that toxic stuff with bloody and whatever the crap else I was talking about earlier. It made no sense. Just now there's just drugs everywhere. Everything is now drugs. This whole, everyone posts something in the comments about drugs. And your head is through the ceiling. Oh, now it's not. Holy crap. What the... Oh, Garrus, you got in the way, buddy. Oh, you're floating, too. I can't shepherd float. I want to float. What the crap is this? Fire in the hole. Look how high they are. Oh, oh, see, it all comes back. It all comes back to the toxic drugs. Yes, that, that, that was the whole point. You know, for being arch rivals, Zalos and Kajido haven't really fought each other all that much. But what will happen when Zalos is challenged this time? This is between you and me. Very well, Zalos, then I challenge you to a duel. Yeah, that's more like it. N no, I mean with cards, you idiot. What? 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 You? What? You want, you want to play a freaking Yu-Gi-Oh game? You want to play a Yu-Gi-Oh game after all the crap you put me through? Yes! Okay, okay, okay. We'll fight with swords instead. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, wait a minute. Where did you get that second sword? Uh, oh, never mind. What, what, now wait a minute. How did you do that? Oh, never mind, whatever. I have the perfect arena for us. Of course, we all know the machines have Captain Blue in them! Kazuto, turn around. Is that you, you son of a... Oh! Oh, hello there! Who's Kazuto? Oh, sorry, I thought you were someone else. No, my name is Captain Blue. Your name is Cap... What? Why would... Okay, never mind. Do you know who Kazuto Nolan is? No, I don't, I'm afraid. But say, you look like you could use some entertainment and some fun. Would you like to try out my new catapult system? Catapult? What are you talking about? Well, you see, it's really quite simple. I catapult you. That... No? That sounds stupid. Oh, come on, it's a lot of fun. No... Okay, if you don't know who Kajido is, like, I'm gonna have to go. It's late. Oh, hello there. My name is Captain Blue, and today, Zealous is letting me do a mod review. I'm gonna review the Midas Magic Catapult. Look at this awesome, amazing catapult. It's just fantastic. It's wonderful. It gets a 10 out of 10. Now, Captain Blue. Captain Blue. What? What is it, Zealous? Look at the catapult. Yes, Captain Blue, but... You, you remember the deal, you have to talk about the features of the catapult and the mod, you can't just give it a 10 out of 10. Well, okay, Lon, alright. Well, you go up to the catapult, and you fly something! Look at the catapult! It launches things into the air, and it sends people flying, and you can try out the catapult, that's fantastic! It's a 10 out of 10 for me! What a fantastic mod! This is the best mod I've ever seen in my entire life! Oh, there goes the orange! Look how far it went! So let's load Kajido's unholy sword. What? You can't do that to my unholy sword. You stop that right now, Cap. Don't you, don't you dare, Captain Blue. Don't you do it. Let's bombs away. No, no, my unholy sword. I need someone to help me film my commercial, and you're the perfect candidate for the cameraman. You need me to, you need me to film a, a, what, a commercial? Yes, it'll be a jolly good time. I promise you'll have lots of fun. What would you possibly do with a commercial in this day and age? Do, do people even have TVs? Oh, come on, Zellers, don't be a poor sport about it. I have something of the utmost importance to tell the public. N no, th that's ridiculous. I'm not going to help you film a commercial. I can think of a thousand better ways to waste my time. You're going to be kidding me, huh? Ah, oh, hello there, Zellers. Say, would you like to try my new catapult?
All right, let's do this commercial thing. Ha, oh, that's preposterous. The best scenes always contain Cleon, immortality and greatness. Oh, yes, but sometimes Captain Blue can get involved as well. The Creepers prepare for their attack, but little do they know that the water zombies have already formed a brigade against them, and that the skeletons are secretly on their side. A Creeper stalks his prey, scouting out the nearby water zombies. His friends watch and wait. One creeper in the distance attempts to mimic the water zombies, perhaps trying to learn how to swim. But over here, the water zombies have backed off. They are giving up their ground to the superior numbers of the creeper army. It appears the skeleton has been outright overwhelmed and he has surrendered. He is trying to run like the stereotypical French person persona that we see on television, but we all know French people really aren't like that one bit. Oh, wait. It seems the zombies have gathered in reinforcements from the hills. The hill zombies. Now the water zombies and the hill zombies combined may have enough firepower to take down the army of creepers. But wait, what is this? The army of creepers has dispersed. Oh, no. The zombies moving through the brush, looking to ambush this poor, innocent, unsuspecting creeper who's staring right at him but has no idea that he's actually there. Could it be the zombies have invaded the creeper homeland, and now the creepers have dispersed? One creeper tries to hide in the water, but the zombies are quickly closing in on him. The moon sets. The sun appears in the distance. This battle, this battle is over, but the Creepers, the Creepers will one day seek redemption against their foes. The water skeletons attack the Pegasus. The Marsh Strings, but the Marsh Strings may be too powerful for this skeleton over here. However, one just kind of looks around and does nothing to help the fight. But wait, no, here he comes. He's trying to overwhelm the water skeletons. But over here, the three water skeletons gang up on the marsh strings, hoping to put an end to its tyrannous reign over the marshland. Uh, another water skeleton has joined the fray over here, making it a two-on-two -two contest. Oh no, but one has fallen. There's now a handicap match. Three marsh strings remain to fight the five skeletons. Who will win? I don't know. But all I do know is that the power of cheese is almighty. And perhaps one day we too can have cheese. The water skeletons vigorously fight against their foes. But the marsh strings may be too powerful for them. Can the water skeletons' numbers overwhelm the remaining marsh strings? Oh, what a powerful blow that was. Oh, hello there! Oh, great, it's Captain Idiot. What do you want? Oh, I'm just here to help watch the action. Shay, would you like to try my new catapult? No, I don't want to try a stupid catapult. Now go away and never bring this up again. I'm trying to call a match here. Oh, shucks, Cleon, you're being such a downer. Let me try and help you, because oh, I, Captain Blue, am an experienced commentator of great vocal ability. So let's see here, we've got these moss strings, using a spin attack of some sort almost, but he manages to take down one of the skeletons. It seems the skeletons are in deep trouble, Cleon. Oh no! Oh, oh but now one of the moss strings has gone down, leaving only one moss string to contend with two skeletons. Who will win this epic battle? I don't know! Oh no! Another skeleton! He's running interference! That's cheating! The skeleton army is cheating! Five and nine! This is... This should be a disqualification right here. Oh! You just don't have an open mind about these things. The Moss Strings definitely deserve this. So that Moss String is going down no matter how well he fights because the skeletons are too much. Oh, says you. One of your fr precious skeleton buddies just went down. Oh, that may be so, but the Moss String, he still has strength. But he will be defeated. Ha ha! Oh, curses. Lost money on that one. Sometimes, Zelos has to get rid of some of his team members. They're not that reliable. Especially the ones that don't watch his stuff. 
There we go. This should do just nicely. You didn't watch my stuff! Oh, you can teleport, huh? Well, we'll fix that. How can I help? Let's see. Okay, I'll catch you later. I bet you will. I'll literally catch you later. Ha 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 Watch my stuff better next time! Watch it! Watch my stuff! Ah! This has been Team Unity for nothing! We. Do Mountain do we I don't think I don't think anybody voted for any StarCraft 2 footage at all, but so here's just some of my favorite scenes in general. It ain't over till it's over, you son of a bitch. Oh, don't do that! Now you need a new TV! My suit. My booze! Captain Planet, he's a hero. Gonna take pollution down to zero. He has a giant laser. And he's gonna shoot everyone in the face with the little little laser. The laser. Oh, stop it. Lots of minerals investing to the lasers. Gonna get you, Captain Planet. He's a hero. Captain Blue is the hero. Stay thirsty, my friends. Stay thirsty for getting old in the face. I'm a hero dressed in blue, and now you can, you can be too, Captain Blue. He's a hero. By the time you're in college, it's like, okay, what the crap ever, you know. I have my thing to do, that guy has his thing to do. But let's dance together. Do 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 And then uh, you get into a giant gunfight. And then you steal this car. You steal beating around in the car. It's like vroom, vroom, and you speed and crash. Ah! Oh man, and then he's like, oh, I lost a half a heart there. Oh man, I need I need injury protection insurance from Mr. Pig. So you go to Mr. Pig's insurance shop, and you're like, Mr. Pig, I need to buy insurance. And he's like, it'll cost you 98 sand. So you're like, oh man, I don't have any sand. Can I pay you back later? He's like, no, you have to pay me now. And you're like, I need the insurance. I need it. I need it. Stop hitting me. No. And then you, before you know it, you've killed Mr. Pig, and you've racked up another uh, felony star thing. So now... Uh, the cops are after you, and you're like, dun, 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 you're all paranoid, looking around your shoulder, and just like, holy crap, where are those cops, man? I don't know where they are. And just like, jolting around and everything, but I don't know where anything's going. And then, suddenly, in the distance, you see a tower. So you look into the tower, and you're like, I'll hide behind this tower. Nobody will find me behind this tower. Do, 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 Oh, man, but you're actually, like, thicker than the tower, so that's no good. So you have to run to the forest and retreat. And you stumble upon the flowers, and you're like, oh man, flowers, yes, yum, 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 ah. and you like, eat the flowers, but they turn out to be drugs, so you're all like, oh, crazy, hyped up on flowers, and you're just running around the forest, shooting at things, and then, with your magical laser sword, and then, uh, the magical laser sword is like, well, I'm not gonna be your magical laser sword, so it just goes away, and you're like, no, magical laser sword, I can change, I can change magical laser sword, so the magical laser sword comes back to you. And you run around with a magical laser sword, looking for something to fight. But it's daytime, so there's nothing to fight outside. And you're like, well, crap, there's nothing to fight outside. So you walk around, and you realize that you had stumbled upon the cave area in take two of the recording session, but you don't remember where it is again. So you start wandering around in the, in the winter plains, and you're like, oh, there's another tower. But is it the Tower of Infinity? No, it's not the Tower of Infinity, because that was in, what, what show was that? I don't remember. I think it was... 
It was a uh, Digimon. No, it wasn't. In, it wasn't even in the show. It was in uh, one of the video games for the show. We were just like, oh, don't we just go over that? You just do that in the last episode, Team UDF. You were talking about anime and video games, so why didn't you talk about that in the last episode? And you're like, I don't know, man. So I'm just gonna take out the sheep with a bow, but not the arrows, because the arrows they are sacred. They are sacred to the sheep. So you cannot waste the arrows against the sheep. But you do anyway. And someone logs on MSN and you're like, Oh, hey, it's Khan. I wonder if Khan's going to be online tonight when I play Halo. And I don't know. And some subscribers are like, Holy crap, you're going to play Halo tonight? Oh, man, can I have your gamer tag? And I'm like, sure, you can have my gamer tag. It's like, okay, we're going to have your gamer tag. And he shows up. Never. Because, like, I don't know. Some people have done that now. They've, like, desperately wanted my gamer tag. But I've never seen them. Because the pig mafia, the pig mafia has just been destroyed. But their ancestors will be back from the dead. Because that's what they do. Their ancestors, the big mafia, the ancestors from the dead. But little do they know, the sheep, the sheep were behind this the whole time. And they were, they were shed by their god. Because the god was like, you can't do that sheep, so as punishment, I'm going to take your wool. And he shot arrows around. And so the arrows, then he started going into the cave. And the arrows, and he started coming out of the cave. And the arrows, and he started walking along the beach line. And the arrows, oh man, the arrows! Last salvation! We have reached the city of flowers. <laughs> and then we roll around in the flowers, in the flowers, frolicking, frolicking. Rituals can be dangerous and scary. This one isn't, though. It's even more dangerous and scary than usual. Just relax now. Sure thing. Hum. 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 Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What is that? Oh, my God. What are you doing to me? Oh, God. Oh. So bad. Who will win when Link has only three hearts and he has to take on two iron knuckles? The emulator. No! No! No, no, no!
alternate save state. No! Yes! 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 Save! Save! Screw! I don't know. You will die! about you guys, but sometimes I think Zellos Phoenix can be a pretty shady character. He shone. What? He shone. What? He shone. What, Hunter? How's it going? Ah, Hunter, it's freezing in here. We have to get more wood for the fireplace soon or we're going to be toast. Ooh, right then. Let's go. It looks like that place is on fire. Yeah! Cowboy Ninja Samurai, Zanos, Zanos, and he's from the future, Zanos, Zanos. Then, of course, there are those times when doing something difficult can give me rage of the Triforce variety. Na 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 Wanna beat the palace of darkness Should have been a breeze But enemies, spice and shooters Bring me to my knees Granted it's much harder at 200% speed but that's no excuse for me, I've got to stay in the lead. Oh, 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 we, oh, 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 how my sword king is guarding the bling. Oh, 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 we, oh, 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 how my sword king is guarding the bling. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no, he can't beat my try force rage. Team UDF is going insane. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no, he can't beat my Triforce Rage. Team UDF is going insane. Tra 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 Triforce Rage, tra tra Triforce Rage, na 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 na. Tra 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 Triforce Rage, tra tra Triforce Rage, na 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 na. Come on, Sasha Shara, we've got to win the game. Otherwise Ganondorf will put us all to shame again But this freaking beast is trying to stand in my way So I'm gonna use this hammer gun to bring his judgment day Oh, 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 we, oh, 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 how my sword king is guarding the bling Oh, 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 we, oh, 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 how my sword king is guarding the bling can't beat my, can't beat my, no he can't beat my Triforce Rage Team UDF is going insane Can't beat my, can't beat my, no he can't beat my Triforce Rage Team UDF is going insane Tra 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 Triforce Rage, tra tra Triforce Rage Na 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 na, tra 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 Triforce Rage, tra tra Triforce Rage Na 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 I am quickly losing patience, need assistance, but I have no fairy, and I'm being far too unwary. I have no clue where I'm going, sense of direction is quite unknowing, just need dungeon maps, dungeon maps, when I wander I run into lots of traps. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no he can't beat my Triforce Rage. Team UDF is going insane. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no, he can't beat my Triforce Rage. Team UDF is going insane. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no, he can't beat my Triforce Rage. Team UDF is going insane. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no, he can't beat my Triforce Rage. 
Team UDF is going insane. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no, he can't beat my dry force rage. Team UDF is going insane. Can't beat my, can't beat my, no, he can't beat my dry force rage. Team UDF is going insane. Tru 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 tri force rage. Tru tru tri force rage. Na 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 na. Tru 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 tri force rage. Tru tru tri force rage. Na 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 na. Tru 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 tri force rage. Tru tru tri force rage. Na 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 na. Tru 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 tri force rage. Tru tru tri force rage. Na 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 na. Tru 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 tri force rage. Tru tru tri force rage. Na 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 na. Tru 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 tri force rage. Tru tru tri force rage. Na 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 na. So after all that, Team UDF, what can you possibly end on? Well, to tell you the truth, I don't have a clue. All I hope is that it's not one of those crappy 2D games. Hey everyone, Team UDF here. Oh man, I've been getting a few requests from people who don't like the 2D games I play. So they, they, they don't like 2D games and think 2D games are stupid. Oh man, I, I totally agree with them. So from now on, no more 2D games. We're just going to do it straight up, man. This is Dimension. We're going to do a Let's Play of Dimension. Here we go. Yeah, this is the ultimate in 1D gaming technology, man. It's all good. We just have to make sure that we totally win the game. Oh, we, we, we got it. Oh, man. We I totally hit it! This is freaking awesome! I, just, I can't believe I've ignored games like this my entire life. I mean, like, there's no reason to play anything else anymore. We just, we just play Dimension all day, man. Everyone has to tell their friends about this. I mean, everyone has to tell their friends about this. This is like, I don't know, I, well, how do you, like, I, 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 I just don't, I, I can't, like, I, 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 this is Dimension. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. We're going to go ahead and end it there because, like I said earlier, I know you, some of you guys have trouble downloading the longer videos. So, yeah, until next time, everyone, stay tuned for more of the old, more of the current, and who knows? Who knows?